Hey guys, it's Katie and welcome to another video. I'm literally just filming before the natural lighting goes, which is great. Otherwise, I'd have to wait like another couple of days before I have to film again because I have busy, busy plans. But in today's video, I'm going to be doing my June wrap up. And June, you know, it felt actually kind of successful because I read like a variety of books and I reread some books and it just felt successful to me really even though i didn't really get a lot of reading done here towards the end i'm still really really satisfied with the reading that i managed to get done so without further ado here goes with my june wrap up so the first book that i read and completed in june it was a reread for me but i had to do it because i really really want to continue on with the series and i am continuing on with it so i reread a court of thorns and roses by sarah j mass i absolutely love this book is so good again five out of five Kit Kats it was just super super awesome and this if you haven't read it I mean you must have been under a rock because honestly it's such a great Beauty and the Beast twist in a YA story it's kind of like a little bit new adult though because there is like a little bit of new adult sauciness in it but it's really cool and I can see like why it's kind of compared to Beauty and the Beast but I did do a review on this and I'll link that down below in the description. But again, it was just fantastic to reread and I absolutely loved and adored it. The next book was also a reread for me. I currently have loaned it to my boyfriend Ben as he sounded really, really interested in it and he watched the movie and he was like, is the movie kind of like the book? And I was like, yes, it's kind of like that in that really sort of sarcastic way. So that is Warm Bodies by Isaac Marion. I'll place the picture over here because I don't actually have the physical copy with me, but it was nice to reread this book. I haven't read it in years and I have the sequel to it, which has not long been released and I'm super excited to get around to reading that and seeing what the sequel is like so yet again with this reread i gave it five out of five kit kats if you haven't read warm bodies it's basically this zombie story where there's this zombie called r doesn't know anything about himself or anything I believe i did a review on this so i will link that down below in the description so you're gonna check more on my thoughts on that but it's just sort of like about him discovering himself as a zombie discovering these humans and sort of having this infatuation with this human female and yeah really really good super super awesome so the last set of books that i managed to complete i started off by reading this physical copy of corpse party and this one is blood covered and it's volume number one it is a bind up of like the first three volumes i believe but i actually really enjoyed this i know of the story because of the computer game and i've watched it i've watched the anime as well so it's nice to sort of read it in the manga form and then i went and read the other mangas of it online so i ended up near enough completing them actually um i think there was like one volume left and uh, so yeah i really really enjoyed it i just skim through these it was just a nice sort of quick read and sort of different to sort of sift through but yeah definitely recommend it it's kind of really gory and i ended up giving them all five out of five kit kats this is basically just sort of about these school children and they end up doing this little paper chant and they pull it and they end up waking up in this school and this school is kind of like haunted and then they see these just haunted kids it's kind of creepy like things are happening and the the windows are tied shut and the doors are locked and that sort of thing and then all of a sudden they unlock and it's just it's weird and creepy and yeah I really really enjoy it it's kind of gory in some places as well so if you really like your horrors if you really like your mangas this is definitely one for you guys to read but I really really enjoyed it also this book I decided to go towards my TBR jar challenge which was to read a book in a series because I read several books that were in the Corpse Party series and also I reread Warm Bodies, I reread Court, uh, Court of Thorns and Roses so those sort of like went towards it as well so I actually read a lot of series in June. I'm really really happy with the reading that I got done because it just means that I can plunge forward into July and just get a bit more reading done. I'm currently in the middle of a couple of books so it will 
would be great for me to get those read but stay tuned for my July TBR which is coming up pretty soon for you to see the books that I am currently reading and will hopefully get around to reading in July. Let me know down below what you guys read in June and how well you did and what you're planning on reading for July but thank you very much for watching my video as always. Keep smiling, keep reading and be happy. My name is Katie and I see all of you wonderful awesome people in my next video. Bye!